Hello everyone, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm down at my local Wardy Bike Park. I'm going to be showing you the three biggest jumps here. Okay, so as you know, if you watched my last video or you've seen my Instagram, I've got a broken wrist. So today I'll be putting the GoPro on James Pratton and he'll be showing you all the biggest jumps, but I'll be documenting it. Okay, so this is James Pratton. I'll leave his Instagram and his YouTube link in the description, but he's going to be the rider for today. And I'm going to basically start with the smallest of the biggest jumps here. And then as we get further into the video, I'll move on to the bigger jump. So let's go over to the first one right now. I'll put the GoPro on James and we'll show you it. Right, so this is the first jump that uh, I'm going to do. It's on hip line. Um, it's probably about six foot lip, maybe seven foot. Um, it's quite tall, but it's not a massive gap, but it's really good for like whips and stuff. And like a few really good riders have flipped it over the years, so uh, I'm going to go up now and try and do something cool. Alright, so as James said there, this is one of the bigger jumps over Wally. There are two more that are slightly bigger, but this will be the first one we're showing you. And it's got about a 15, 16 foot gap. Um, there are bigger jumps here, but this one gives you one of the most airtime over Wally. And it's probably one of the most fun ones to do tricks on. So. Let's get James coming down and then we'll show you it. Okay, so after that hip line jump, we'll now come over to Big Hip. And this is probably about an 18, 19 foot gap. Um, and as well as it being quite long, it's also a hip. So I'll let James talk you through it and then we'll put a GoPro on him and get some more shots of it. Right, so this is the Big Hip. Uh, there's a step down through some trees into a big berm and then we've just got this takeoff. It's a bit uh, messed up at the moment because people are breaking up and stuff but yeah you can sort of take off there if you want to go small and take off here if you want to go really big and hip it. And then I'd say it's probably about 20 odd foot and the landing's over here for about 8 foot wide. Okay, so we've now come over to the last jump I'm going to be showing you today, and this is called Road Gap. So it's on Moon Line, and it goes over another trail called High Line. Um, and this one's about 20, 22 foot. And that's not actually the longest jump here, but it definitely gives you the most air time. And the lip is about six foot tall, maybe a tiny bit taller. And there's someone coming in for it now. So as you can see there, this jump very sketchy, as well as it being big. So James will talk you through it, and then we'll get a GoPro clip. Right, so the reason this jump is so deaf because you're coming with so much speed and the lip is just not really got much transition, to be honest with you, it's not built the best. Um, but it's, it is a fun jump, to be fair. Um, but yeah, it just it just kicks you up so high and it's very unpredictable. And uh, a lot of people have, uh, have had a little crash on this in the past, but um, hopefully we'll get a good run in and uh, go and hit it now. All right, so the takeoff's right over here and then the landing's over there. And... It's also a tiny bit hips, it doesn't look as big as it actually is, but it is very deaf. So I'll stand a bit further back when James comes down. Okay everyone, that is the end of the video. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe and hope you enjoyed it. Anyway, I'll see you next week.